Long ago, when only stars shone in the sky, there lived a mother with her son and daughter in a small house on a mountainside. Children, I must go and work and bring back food. Be careful. And she set off with her basket down the mountain where she worked for a rich man. And when she returned through the forest, she met a tiger. I will eat you. I will give you a rice cake. The tiger ate the rice cake and the mother hurried on, but the tiger came after her. I'm still hungry. Give me two more. Two more is all I have, one for my son and one for my daughter. Give them to me. The tiger ate the two rice cakes and came after the mother again. I'm still hungry. And he ate her up. Then he put on the mother's clothes, took the basket and ran, looking for the house on the mountainside where he knew the children were waiting. Let me in, I'm your mother. Our mother has a soft voice. I am your mother, said the tiger. Show us your hand, said the daughter. The tiger put his hairy paw under the door. Our mother's hand is soft and white, not like this. The tiger covered his heavy paw in white rice flour from the bottom of the basket and put it under the door again. Seeing this, the children opened the door and let the tiger in. The tiger was wearing their mother's clothes. The children thought she looked strange, but then the boy noticed the tiger's tail. Quick, sister, run! The children ran from the house as fast as their legs would carry them till they came to a tall tree. They climbed up the tree which stood above a well. When the tiger reached that place, he looked all around. Look down the well, I see you. He saw the children's faces reflected in the water. He reached down with his paw to scratch them and catch them with his claws. But the girl in the tree laughed at the foolishness of the tiger. The tiger looked up and leapt up into the tree. The children cried, Oh God, hand us down a strong rope. If you want to save us, if you want the tiger to devour us, then hand us down a rotten rope. The rope that fell from the heavens was strong, and the boy and the girl climbed up out of the tiger's reach. The tiger was already at the top of the tree. Oh God, send me down a rope. And a rope fell, and the tiger began to climb. Soon he could eat the boy and the girl. But this rope was rotten. The rope snapped, and the tiger fell, crashing to the world. The boy and the girl in heaven became the sun and the moon. The boy, the moon, the girl, the sun. But the girl was afraid of the darkness, so they changed places. And the boy became the moon, and the girl is the sun. She blushes shyly, and the heat from her cheeks warms us in the world below. This story, Sun and Moon, was told to me by Unji Cho from Korea. I'm David Heathfield. I'm in the trees near the River Otter in Devon. It's Saturday the 13th of June 2020 and this for you is a breath of fresh air.